Before drawing pipe, you need to add control valve symbols to the design. To determine how many control valves are required and where they should be located, it is usually necessary to assign sprinklers to zones using the zoning command before placing the control valve symbols. You can open the control valves command from the irrigation menu or by clicking on the toolbar icon. To locate the desired valve, you must first select a manufacturer from the drop-down menu. Click on the down arrow and then click on the manufacturer of your choice. Click on the control valve of your choice at the listing. Once you have selected a control valve, you may need to adjust the symbol or color for representation on the design. Pro Contractor Studio comes with multiple symbols to represent a control valve on the design screen. You may edit any of these symbols or create your own. To assign a symbol to the selected valve, click on the drop-down arrow to the right of the symbol label. Click one time on the symbol with the left mouse button to assign the symbol to the selected control valve. To assign a color to the symbol, click on the color button. Click on a predefined color of your choice, click somewhere inside the color box, or move the slider bar to select the color assignment. You may also enter the red, green, and blue values in the associated text boxes. Once you have determined the color, click on the OK button to accept the color assignment. You will not need to go through this process each time you start the program. Once you've made your symbol and color assignments, they will remain intact until you change them. If this valve is to be used as a master valve, click on the Master Valve checkbox until a checkmark appears in the box. Click on the OK button to begin placing the symbol on the drawing screen. Roll the scroll button on the mouse to zoom in on an area, or press and hold down the scroll button to move or pan the drawing around on the design screen. The symbol will appear on the mouse cursor. Drag the symbol to the desired location on the drawing screen and click one time with the left mouse button. Rotate the symbol to the desired angle and click a second time to complete the placement process. Another control valve of the same type will appear on the mouse cursor. You can continue placing additional control valve symbols as necessary. It is up to you as the designer to determine the best location for the control valve symbols. You can group the symbols in a manifold layout, or you can locate the symbols close to the associated sprinkler zones. You can make use of the polar tracking feature to assist in lining up symbols, or press the P key to turn the feature off. When you have finished placing control valves, press the Escape key to end the command and return to the dialog box. You can select a different control valve and continue the process, or click on the close button to exit the command. You will need to use the zoning command to assign control valves to a zone number prior to sizing pipe.